You all remember the Great Jibo Massacre of 2017, and so do we. Actually, I'm pretty sure they blame us for sinking their company. So, when Kiai reached out to sponsor this video about their ClickBot educational robot, my eyebrows just about raised right off my head. But we wouldn't be making this video if the ClickBot was yet another colossal waste of money that barely does anything. So let's unleash the Krakens on it and see what our newest family member can do. This cute modular robot from Kiai is the product of a successful Kickstarter funded back in February of 2020, with backers being able to pledge anywhere from $2.99 for the Early Bird Starter Kit to $6.99 for the Early Bird Maker Kit, with plenty of options in between. You can build basically anything you want with all the pieces in the kit, but they have some suggested ones. So the two main ones are boy, Bic <laughs> and Back. So Back is kind of like a tall, skinny boy, moves around, and then Bic has wheels. So that's why we've actually got wheels included in our kit. So which one do you guys want to build, Bic or Back? Bic. Bic, please. Bic. I had kind of planned for us to do the other one first. Can you work with me on this? Yeah. Can yeah. we do okay. back first? Yeah. Okay. okay. Some of the more advanced features are going to be a little complicated for a younger audience, but they figure anyone ages eight and up can probably assemble it. So why don't we get you to take a crack at the assembly? We're going to start with the head and wait a second, my boy. Yeah, you can put it together any way you want, but we're going to start by not doing a random one. We're going to start with back. So that's your next piece. So we got this one. And now we need another one of them. That's right. Okay. Have you figured out how to put it together, my boy? I have. Oh, did you figure out how to put it together? So this comes off. Okay, that you gotta put that one together. Suction cup. Yeah, so I guess you can suction it onto something. Are there more pieces? Because it looks like we've got a foot here. That's oh my goodness, that. two suction cups? Okay. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> okay. Oi, hi. Wow, it's got lights on it. Whoa. Has mount already been stickied on the desk? Yeah. There's a few things you can do. So you can try tickling Back's head. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Does someone want to try to cover Back's eye? Me, please. Okay, go for it. How? With your hands. Oh. You gotta try. <laughs> There's a few things we can do here. There's Back's play box. Wave left or right about 10 centimeters in front of Back to select an answer before the countdown ends. Okay. The fastest bird is an ostrich or a, a what? A <laughs> castle ostrich. I have no idea. So far then, it actually does seem pretty Jibo-like, but that's okay. We're coming to the, but wait, there's more moment. We got the full kit, which still costs less than a Jibo, by the way, and can be used to build any number of different robots. Ones that have been pre-tested by Kiai or the community or your own creations. So why don't we build the other starter robot and try some of the other functionality? The instructions are here in the main menu, but you can see there's all of uh, the stuff in here, meet friends, update, settings. So this is a whole, and then there's, there's your connection settings here. So let's go Bic to calibrate. Please connect as follows. Apple B, blah, 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 blah. All right, here we go, ready? So I need one of those. Here. That's kind of cool. It just gives you like the next step. They don't even need all the robot functionality to have fun with this stuff, apparently. Wait, we're building back again. What the heck? Well, I guess we can watch back dance now. That's why they call him back, because he comes back. Get it? That's how, that's how I can tell the difference between staff that I pay and my own children. Touchscreen could be a little, sensitivity could be tweaked a little. There's some constructive feedback for the Ki team. There we go, dance. Okay, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, that was dance mode. We want to get into building Bic mode. So there you go. We've got Bic selected in the menu. We're gonna click that and it says, remove all the flashing modules. Okay guys, tear off all the flashing ones. Rip it apart. Kill them. <laughs> so now do you see the instructions on the screen? Yeah. So you gotta do that. 
All right, you got it? There we go. Anyone can balance okay, like Okay, keep Bic standing on a flat surface. Oh wow, it really does balance itself Segway style. That's pretty cool. Oh. What? No what? <laughs> no, you're not a person. I'm pretty sure I'm a person. <laughs> so we're gonna try one of the ones in like the community thing. Oh, wrong module position. Gosh darn it. I'll take it off. I got it wrong again? The other side. You have to put it on the other side of the head. Oh. Well, all right, smarty pants. Why don't you do it then? There we go. That's kind of cool. Look at this. It's got like a 3D view if you have trouble kind of lining things up. Now we need kind of like a butt tail thing. There we go. Uh, okay, I need another sphere. More sphere. I have one. Yes, you do. You have three. What the heck are we even making? A race car. Okay, now we need wheels, kids. Wheel me. Okay, so there's like a pressure sensitive foot that goes in here. Okay. Wrong module position. Why does it need a foot? Okay, where's my next wheel? What? This is a race car. Okay, you know what? Sure, fine. Oh, we're doing awesome now. I'm getting the hang of this. All right, I need another sphere. Sphere me. You might need some, you might need some help from your big brother. Oh, wow, good job. So now what we can do is we can use the phone app to drive it around. Select reset to adjust posture. Yeah. Oh, hi. Okay. You guys want to try the racer? Yes, please. All right, me too. How fast does it go? Oh, wow, okay. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, who wants to try it? Me, please. Put your thumb on, the, yeah, there you go. Okay, you gotta go a different direction now. Back, see? And forward, ah, you gotta go get Andy. Ah. Okay, you try it, you press the other mode. So now what does it do? <laughs> now what's cool is that if you build your own, you can actually program little animations and stuff like that by setting up what are essentially keyframes manually and then playing them back. So you could have it go get something or go back and forth. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, so let's see what it's doing. Okay, so, so like things like this. <laughs> now it does have these little locks if you have a model that's kind of top heavy or something. <laughs> Once you're familiar with the motion control, you can also go in and create your own AI programs for ClickBot with the simple graphical user interface that allows anyone to visually script to their heart's content. The community is also constantly uploading new videos showcasing just what ClickBot can do. And with a helpful online community of like-minded makers, you can be sure to find solutions online to problems you might encounter when trying to program or put together ClickBot yourself. They're also a great source of inspiration if you're not sure where to start or where to go next in your bot building journey. The lack of ability to connect it to a terminal isn't the only blemish. You're limited to 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi, there aren't any error lines for failing code, and the app did have to be reset a few times to fix some instances of freezing. However, Kiai's YouTube channel has a lot of tutorials for beginners, and ClickBot is already getting firmware updates, so we would expect some of these bugs to disappear or at least lessen in the future. This also leaves room for new features to be added on top of the 200 plus interactions it can already perform. Oh, poor you. Wow, it really does look like a wounded animal. It runs for about two hours between charges, making it a pretty fun gift for the tech-savvy kid in your life, or for anyone who's looking to relive their childhood dream of having a robotic friend. Or, well, really any friend. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, thanks, Kiai, for sponsoring this video. If your kids are still too young for the ClickBot, make sure to check out our ABCs of Gaming board book at lttstore.com. Totally unbiased review. How's the ABCs of Gaming? Is it a good book? Thanks for that. Uh, and if you're looking for another video to watch right now, how about our review of Jibo? It's basically, well, it, it tried to be this, but it was so much less than this. But it does twerk. <laughs>